Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Anand, your pediatrics faculty. Today's topic of choice we're gonna talk about is cardiology. Yes, cardio, 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 everything about cardio. So top 20 points about cardiology. Question number one, which is the most common, which is the most common congenital heart disease in full cardiology? I'll repeat again, which is the most common congenital heart disease in full cardiology? Please remember the answer for this question is VSD. What is VSD? Ventricular septal defect, VSD. Now VSD ventricular septal defect, the first question is, is this a right to left shunt or is this a left to right shunt? Right to left or left to right? Please remember, always remember the left side of the heart has a higher pressure than the right side of the heart. That is why ASD, VSD and PDA, all these three are left to right shunt. I'll repeat again, name some left to right shunts. The answer is ASD, VSD and PDA. First question is over that the most common congenital heart disease in full cardiology is a ventricular septal defect. Now, which is the most common synotic congenital heart disease? Yes, which is the most common synotic congenital heart disease? The most common synotic congenital heart at day of life one, if the child is a one day old baby, then the answer is TGA. The most common synotic congenital heart at day of life one is TGA. Now question number one, what is TGA? TGA is transposition of great arteries. Yes, transposition of great arteries. And here only if I ask you a question in TGA, what is the X-ray finding we have? We have egg on side appearance. So TGA, you see egg on side appearance. If I ask you top 10 X-rays in cardiology, where do you see boot shaped heart? So boot shaped heart, it is seen in tetralogy of fallow. Where do you see box shaped heart? Box shaped heart, it is seen in Epstein anomaly. Where do you see figure of three appearance? So figure of three appearance, very importantly, remember you see in coarctation of aorta. Yes, figure of three appearance, you see in coarctation of aorta. And where do you see figure of eight appearance? Figure of eight appearance, you see in supracardic TAPVC. Figure of eight appearance, you see in supracardic TAPVC. Remember, figure of eight appearance, you don't see just in TAPVC, supracardic, supracardic TAPVC. Quick question, TAPVC, what is the full form of TAPVC? It is total anomalous pulmonary venous connection. Total anomalous pulmonary venous connection. So figure of three, coarctation of aorta. Figure of eight, supracardic TAPVC. Box shape heart, Epstein anomaly. And boot shape heart, tetralogy of fallow. Last segment, tetralogy of fallow. If I ask you a very quick question, trilogy, tetralogy and pentalogy of fallow, what are the defects associated? In trilogy of fallow, remember the mnemonic that is RAP. I'll repeat again, RAP, R-A-P. R for right ventricular hypertrophy, A for atrial septal defect and P for pulmonary stenosis. So trilogy of fallow is over. Now comes tetralogy of fallow. Tetralogy of fallow. Tetra means four components. What are the four components we have in tetralogy of fallow? Number one, right ventricular hypertrophy. We have pulmonary stenosis. We have ventricular septal defect and we have overriding of aorta. So tetralogy of fallow is over. Now the last question, what is pentalogy of fallow? Penta. Penta means five. What are the five components of pentalogy of fallow we have? We have all the components of tetralogy of fallow plus a atrial septal defect. So TOF plus ASD, that is pentalogy of fallow. So that finishes trilogy, tetralogy and pentalogy of fallow. Quick revision, the most common asynotic congenital heart in cardiology is a VSD. The most common synotic congenital heart in cardiology, if the baby is a one day old, the answer is TGA. Otherwise, the answer is TOF. What is TOF? Tetralogy of fallow, where you see boot shaped heart. And what is TGA? Transposition of great arteries, where you see very importantly, egg on side appearance. Thank you so much everyone. Do like, share and subscribe. And please let us know in the comment section, which next topic in this beautiful imaginary world, you want a beautiful, you know, representation of the topic. So please take care and thank you. And before leaving, we always have a quote. And the quote for today is, life is beautiful the quote for today is successful is the one who enjoys his daily routine so make sure you enjoy your life because life is just one so please take care and thank you